Good day and welcome back to Coach Creek. In today's video, we are going to be looking to be more explosive through the crease and to help ourselves ball faster. Every seam bowler in the world wants to ball that little bit quicker or hit the deck a little bit harder to give them some more opportunities when a batter is playing against them. So to do that, we need to get stronger and more explosive power through the crease. To help us get more explosive power, we are going to go through three different draws to help us explode into the crease and to help us get through the crease at a good pace. For the first draw, we are going to try and get into a strong power position where the knees are slightly bent. We are going to be throwing the medicine ball down into the ground next to us, activating our core at the same time and trying to get a nice motion through the arms. This is going to help us strengthen our core at the same time while generating power through a swing with a heavier medicine ball. For the second draw, we are going to set up a hurdle. The bowler is going to be standing with his front leg up already, ready to go snap over in front of the front hurdle and brace. Holding the medicine ball in his hands, he is going to have a nice full rotation from the top, extending his hands nice and forward and throwing the ball down next to him and a little bit backwards. This is to make sure that the bowler has power throughout his entire action and that the arms are forced to extend and complete a nice full rotation to release the ball. For the next draw, we're going to focus on getting nice and high in our jump in our action and the drive through in the crease. It's important to note that a little bit of a jump going up and forward at the same time gives you enough time to get into a nice strong position and then explode from there through the crease. The hurdle at the front is used to make sure that your front leg goes over and snaps to help drive your body forward and in a straight line. This is going to make all our energy go towards our target, giving us more chances to ball the ball a little bit quicker. The front hurdle is also used to make sure that the back leg keeps driving forward and nice and high, that we don't drag it and lose some power by our weight dropping down in the action. Thank you for watching the video. If you did enjoy, please leave a like below. Also remember to comment on what you found useful and what you'd like to see in the future. Please also subscribe and hit that bell notification so you can get the information and the content as soon as it releases.